There's a door down here in the undercroft that we haven't opened. I can come down if I can figure it out. With like a fancy um, Origins teleporter inside. Ooh. Okay. Oh, yeah. It's the Dorais teleporter. Yeah. I mean, you want to go somewhere? Yeah. Oh, we killed, killed a zombie. Oh! Oh, God. Huh. Well, that's definitely different. Well, well, well. Look what series is back for a bit of a different round. Did I fall asleep for eight years yet again, sir? No, you're all good, Reginald. Today, we are here to commit a chronological crime. We are playing the brand new zombie mode in Modern Warfare 3 that came out basically a week ago. Oh. Yes, uh, probably forever, Reginald, until both of us die. Well, at least until I die. I don't really know what's happening with you. The content machine churns ever forward, but previously we were fully committed to playing every zombie map in chronological release order, so why have I decided to break that commitment and to the most extreme extent possible? Well, it's because of this bastard right here. I've mentioned it a few times across this series, but the one zombie mode that me and Jameson actually have played is Outbreak in Cold War. We use Outbreak mode as our Mythbuster testing ground. It was a super spacious map to explore and experiment in, and also, most importantly, it had vehicles. Vehicles are specifically a constant pain to test with in a nice controlled environment, because there are no such thing as ground war custom matches. The majority of the 4v4 or 5v5 maps in Call of Duty don't have any vehicles in them, so in most of the modern Call of Duties to do any vehicle based myths we would have to dive into public ground war matches which is always an absolute nightmare. But with Cold War we had Outbreak. It was really helpful and we got a bunch of super weird and cool vehicle myth busting done. And the only thing I've really heard about the Modern Warfare 3 zombie mode is that it is basically a spiritual successor to Outbreak. Which means we are going to have to dive in for myth buster content and I can't just cut out a major exploration challenge chunk of an upcoming zombie game, that's the whole point of this series, so I guess we have to do this. Today we are exploring Modern Warfare Zombies? MWZ? I'm not sure what this mode is even called, honestly. Just to clarify, this is simply exploration and exploration only. We are not going to be super thorough. We are not going to be doing all the missions. I don't think there's a main quest easter egg, but that's obviously not happening today. We're just going to be getting to the point where we know enough where we can get into our myth busting in this sandbox. I want to leave as much as possible for the future, but regardless, exploring this map is a thing which has to be done. So let's see where the zombies mode is in 2023. If you guys just saw chapter 11, you will know that a brand new Call of Duty game means we need a section of me and Jameson being extremely confused at cumbersome and bad Call of Duty menus. Die in the match with a contraband weapon, you don't keep it. If you exfil with weapons that aren't your favorite, they get added to your contraband weapon pool for the next <laughs> one, I think is what it said. Um, so in short would mean if you die, you don't lose it, I guess. Correct. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to take some contraband because I don't know how to, like... I don't have any guns. <laughs> yeah, I'm just taking some <laughs> contraband weapons because who cares? Yeah, yeah. Right now. To start, at least. Start Operation Deadbolt, but on the right, there's Story Missions, Act 1. Yeah. Yeah, there's, like, three acts. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There's a whole button here that says Zombies Cinematic. I don't see that on my screen. It's not there. It don't exist. Should we just, I'll just click start Operation Deadbolt. How about that? Yeah, these look very generic, like open 25 loot caches, repair a vehicle tile. This looks like very, like stuff you just naturally do. Oh, yeah, 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 I see that, yeah. Oh, there's a story mission at the very bottom that I presume you have to do. Where's Dr. Jansen? Oh, whatever, let's just play and see what happens. Okay, kind of interesting. Game takes like a long time to realize it's just two of you want to play. Yeah, well, no, I think like... I think there are other humans in the matches, right? It's not just going to be us. It's, what? But it'll just be us in the squad. What? I I'm pretty sure. There's other people in this game? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. It's like like you said, like DMZ. Oh, I didn't know there's other human beings in the game. Not, they're going to fight us? I don't know. I don't think so. I think it's like there's like 20 humans across a big Warzone map, but we're all on the same team against the zombie. I don't really know. I, I what? Haven't, I, that's what I think. I didn't know there was anyone else in this map. Yeah, I think I think there's other people. Not other people. As long as they're not enemies. If they're enemies... Well, what else would they be? They're going to be friends. Why would they even be on the map? Uh, I think they're not enemies. I don't know. I, I 
Well, like just 20 people playing together? I think, maybe? I don't know. We're, I guess we'll find out the hard way here. I don't believe those guys are going to be our friends. <laughs> well, this looks nice. Purple sunset. Yeah, sure. Yeah, I like it. I like it. Hi, zombie. As a zombie. Yeah, okay. Um, I like the, the smog. The fog looks nice. It looks cool. There's like a weird purple light up here. I'm going to investigate. Oh god, I'm getting like achievement progress slowly top right. One out of 50,000. Dude, what was that a thing on Steam? Oh god. Oh it's, a, oh, it's like a redeploy. Oh my god, I'm getting a pop-up every time I kill a zombie. Oh, I'm not getting any of that. Two out of 50,000. Holy shit. <laughs> no, please. That's Whoa. just a uh, like Whoa. redeploy balloon. Oh yeah, a little redeploy. That's cool. There's a guy up here. He's sniping zombies. I think it's a player. Look, is he a friend? It's another player. Where, where, where? Let's go find him. I'm shooting at him. Uh, yeah, he, they're enemies, dude. They're not friends. Uh, oh, good. He's got a hit marker on him. Oh, doggy. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. What the fuck? There's a... What the sh... There's a guy. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the fuck? I don't know what his deal is. Ah! He's, like, slurping my blood, dude. Yeah. Dude, I'm getting fucked up. Yeah, I feel like we're in, like, a super hard zone or something. Some of don't die. No, I feel like uh, this is a, a bad place. <laughs> oh my god, the achievement thing is stacking as well. Oh it's like god. rolling down my screen. Here, you try like... something. What does this do? God. Oh, that Ow, was exciting. my blood's getting slurped. This zombie, I'm finding a zombie, he, he's taken, like, he just took, like, eight shotgun shots to kill. These guys aren't dying, dude. Yeah, I, I'm gonna run away. I feel like... This is a bad zone. I don't get it. Oh, look on the map. God, there's like... Fuck off. They're so fast, dude. I think this is like tiers of difficulty. Like the exterior of the map in the gray zone is... Uh, who hit me? Oh, you're dead. Also, I don't know. I, I see like what looks like enemy or human pings on the map, but they're all blue. Like they'd be friendly. I'm not sure. I don't think they're friends, man. These zombies have so much health. Jesus Christ, dude. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess we're gonna find out what happens when you die. Oh. Yeah, I can just revive you. It's like DMZ. Yeah. <laughs> My guy's so dead. Just passed down the staircase. Okay, once you're up, take a look on the map. What the? F it looks like we're in. There's like three tiers of difficulty on the map. Oh right? my the god! Gray, orange, red. Um, I'm gonna go out oh. into the gray zone because I don't like this red, this orange zone. Oh. Too much happening right now. There's an insta kill up there, but there's just the zombies just don't stop coming, dude. Oh yeah, look at that. Give me this insta kill. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fuck you. Okay. Jesus Christ. That's something. Oh, ammo. Thank God. Yeah, I see, see what you mean about this like circle. We're like in level two. It looks like. Yeah, and you also see what like. It looks like other players and those like, I don't know, blue is a friendly color, <laughs> but I don't know. Maybe there are also enemy. I, I don't know. Who knows? I definitely shot a real person. Really? Hmm. Of course, me and Jameson instantly ran into a tier two zone to begin. I feel like whatever gameplay direction you can go in as a brand new player to have the most confusing and overwhelming initial impression, that is where me and Jameson are just instinctively gonna go. We somehow always sniff it out and fall into that trap. What the? Oh god, there's like weird symbols on the wall over here. They look like old zombie easter egg symbols. <laughs> oh, there's a wall buy weapon near you. Quick revive is near you as well. Quick revive and wall buy. Alright. Um, core 45 looks like a pistol. How much is quick revive? Uh, I'm not sure. I'd imagine 1500. You can't break that law. I don't know. They're already breaking a lot of, laws. There's a lot of zombie laws right here. It's 2000. They broke the rules. You can't do that. I'm not surprised. In this tier, zombies do die kind of at a normal pace. Yeah, that, that makes sense. Oh, I found a gun in a crate. Medium rucksack. It's like bigger backpacks. Okay, that makes sense. Oh, what the... What the fuck? There's the dude from Cold War, the like giant robot man is here. I don't know what that is. From Outbreak. You'll recognize him if you see him. There's fucking proximity mines on his staircase. Who put these here? What pervert did this? Did some... What the... You can't go prone beneath them? <gasps> you can't do that. They're breaking the laws. 
Is this a player who did this? Oh shit, there's a fucking turret! Ah! Ah. Where am I? Did a real man do this? The fucking Kevin McAllister's little pleasure palace over here. Oh no. Oh! Oh! Are you okay? What, what's what's oh. going on? I thought it was a real dude. It wasn't a real dude. It was a mercenary. Ah, see? Yeah, Send I think. Send transmission to H7. Oh, is this a sniper? Dude, this mode's kind of interesting, honestly. I think the... I think... Okay, there's a human... There's a blue dot nearby. I want to see if he's a... If this is a human and if he's a friendly or not. Yeah, yeah. I see him over there. Where is that? He's over here. Okay, I have to go investigate. Whoa! Holy shit! That was cool. <laughs> What is this? <laughs> Why is this gun? This is sick. Okay, yeah, they're it's friend. They're friendlies. They are friendly. Yeah, 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 yeah. So the humans are all friendly on the map. Why are they here? <laughs> you know? I don't know. Why are they here? Because it's DMZ and they just stapled zombie stuff onto it in six months, <laughs> right? Yeah, in like DMZ, they were they were a threat, though, weren't they? They were like, true. Oh, scary, random. Ah! Ah! This is kind of cool, dude. This hotel was like bugged by an AI guy. He was a mercenary and he's up here sniping. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, weird. Whoa. There's like an origin portal thing on this wall up here. Oh. This is asking for a code. This might be the thing you saw. I think you said something about symbols. Yeah, that they're like weird purple symbols on the wall? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm seeing the same thing. Oh, yeah, this. Okay. Um, Let me go. I know where the code is. I'll be back. I'm going to go find it again. What? Yeah, I saw the, I saw, oh yeah, yeah. So I saw, they were just like scrawled. There was like three of them on the wall, like side by side by oh, side. Oh, shit. Let me go see if I can find that again. Where was yeah, that? Yeah, aren't you, aren't you? Oh yeah, here we go. Okay. I mean, oh God, these are so difficult to describe. <laughs> just describe them. You got this. One of them is like a, an an arrow. Yeah. One of them is like a U and one of them is like a figure eight. Yeah, got it. Zero point interdimensional portal cost a thousand. Shot. Whoa. Whoa. Uh. Hope there's not a time limit on here. Wait for me. I, I want to see this shit. Uh. Oh, I think it was just a. It just teleported me like two feet. <laughs> oh, that's exciting. Wait, did it just teleport me to the room where you got the code? Oh, is it in the football stadium? Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's that's where it. Yeah. What? Huh? <laughs> Why? Wow, that's exciting. Oh god, you scared me. What? What's... Huh? What? What's the point of that? I don't know. The only purpose for these portals that I can think of is maybe these codes are a constant through every match. So you can maybe memorize these and use them at a later time. Maybe when you actually are on the opposite side of the map. But if that's not correct and these codes are different per map, then I have no idea. Maybe if your squad splits up, then this could be useful. But apart from that, I'm not sure yet. What's the purple ball? Can I shoot it? Yeah. I think I remember this from Outbreak. Yeah, I think I do too. What does this do? Oh, that's fun. It's like a black hole throwable. I don't remember where I got that, but that's kind of cool. Big guy. I remember this guy from Cold War. That was the guy I was talking about from Cold War, yeah. Ah, I'm out of here. I'm going back to my safe spot. There's a rocket launching. What the hell? Ow! Is double points double money? There's no points in this mode. Yeah, it's the money. Do you want to, like, get that and sell stuff, right? Uh, oh yeah, probably, eh? That makes- that would be smart. Well, because you don't get money, really, do you? Well, you get money from killing guys. Are you sure I've got any money from killing anyone? Uh, yeah, you get a little, little bit. Let me see here. Okay. I'm at 1265, I'm gonna kill one guy. Yeah, I got, uh, 15 points for killing a zombie. Ah. There's like a safe here. I can't do anything with it. But you're right, yeah. Selling stuff with double XP seems like the smart thing. This gun is sick. <laughs> like it a lot. There's like weird mercs that have showed up at my contract over here, and I don't know what's going on anymore. What gun have you got to like really hold your own over that? I don't, really. I found a green <laughs> tier assault rifle, and I'm just doing my best. Making it work. Sort of. I don't know the overall objective, but it's it's got a level of like meandering chillness, which I'm not against, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's very low, I don't know, thought. Seems low, yeah, low stakes, low thought. It feels very casual. Yeah. It's like a nest in here? Cyst, beautiful. I'm dead. <laughs> Shit. Okay. How far away are you? Oh, I'm way over here. 
Oh no, we're gonna fail the contract. Go, monkey bomb. Oh no, we failed. Monkey bomb, good. Did some good damage. I'm gonna get a mission box, and it's gonna be good, and then I'm gonna come get you. Yeah, it's fine. I just bleed out and lie on the floor as a corpse, so. <laughs> it was a purple. Oh, nice. Ow. So tons of AI, human AIs spawned in and killed me. I think the only thing I don't like is that you'd have to learn the entire Modern Warfare weapon catalog to, like, master this mode, right? I don't know if that's true, because I, I have no idea how the weapon tiers work right now. Like, it's... I, yeah, I don't know. Hey! King Kryptonite. Hey, man. He's got some, uh, look, he's got some Wonder Weapon. Ow! He's shooting at me. Uh, there are, hu there are human AI enemies over there with guns. It's annoying. Oh, yeah. This fucking thing in my top right, dude. <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> what is this? Whoa, he's got, uh, he's got, um, uh, what's the, the dolphin, with the dolphin dive explosion perk? What's that thing called? Ow! Um, ah, I got grenaded by them <laughs> fuckers. <laughs> That's I mean, awesome. What is it called? I can't remember. Uh, you know what I mean, though. Yeah, I do, yeah. Yeah, it's good. He just came over and just started dolphin diving around and killed everyone for me. PhD flopper? PhD flopper, that's the one. A, this guy's gonna shoot you. Wouldn't you want to, like, team up with every human player and then just, like... Well, I, don't, I guess I don't really know what you... What the... Okay. Wow, this guy is, like, unkillable. <laughs> He's gonna riot shoot. I'm hurt. I'm punching him in the back. Eh. Okay, he's dead. Look at that cool gun. My god. Yeah, I don't understand Wonder Weapons yet. If he dies, can we take it? Let him die. <laughs> Whoa. Ooh, that's cool. Ooh. Whoa. I like that. My big broad question right now that we don't know the answer to is what do you do in this mode? Like, what? Not sure. Like, it's, there's 20 minutes left and it's like, to do what? Because <laughs> it doesn't escalate like wave no. based. It's just. There's just lots of it. Just there's just lots of them running around, and that's it. Well, if it's like DMZ, you got to uh, exfil. Right to keep your guns, I guess. Yeah. To keep, oh, right, right, right. Yeah, you keep your weapon to get loot and then leave. I, yeah. And there was the missions as well. I want to get like a vehicle and just drive into the red zone and see what's in there. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Okay, man. There was a boat. There's a boat just here. Let's do that. Is he gonna come join us? He's just up there. I'm gonna wait for him. Maybe he'll come. Okay, maybe I'll come with us. He's coming. <laughs> come, come, come. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's coming. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's coming. Hello, sir. Come aboard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. <laughs> we need him for this red zone. He's not going to like us going in here, but... Well, he's got a wonder weapon. High threat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sea town. Oh, this is cool. Boosh. Ooh. I'm going in. I like this. See, this is why there's random humans, but it's to make friends. But this is Call of Duty. You don't make friends in Call of Duty. I know. It's... I know. It feels weird, doesn't it? It does feel weird. When was the last time you made friends with a random in Call of Duty? Ah, uh, yeah, it happened. Oh my god, this. Okay, here we go. Let's see. Like 25 years ago? Oh my god. This guy's unkillable. I don't even think I'm dealing damage to him. Oh, I am. Okay, well, we had a good run. I killed a dog. <laughs> I run. Wow. <laughs> we both run. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I think I, like, when you kill a dog, it leaves fire behind. Ah! I do like that, yeah. He leaves fire behind and kills zombies. There was an armored zombie that I put an entire clip into, and I think I got maybe 5% of his health off. Ah, fuck! I'm down. I guess we're going to find out what happens when we both die. This random guy can't res me, right? I don't think so. Oh, he's down too. <laughs> he's I down have too. no idea. <laughs> we sabotaged him. <laughs> Probably need like a, like a wonder weapon and... Perks, probably. Oh yeah, perks. We forgot to buy <laughs> a right. single perk. <laughs> I did forget Wait, you're about getting revived. Perks. Oh, he's a reviver me! Oh my god. Legend. My hero. Wow, wow, wow. Beautiful. Yeah, he's he's like, we're getting out of here. <laughs> Sorry, Jameson. Oh yeah, this guy. Oh, that guy. The mangler killed you. Oh, uh, no, that wasn't the guy that killed me. It was just a normal armored zombie, and he just destroyed me. How do I get you back? I wonder if you go to a buy station, if you could buy me back. What if I can't get you? Then... I'm gonna come back and get you. Then, yeah, there you go. There's a perk which lets me go like invisible or some shit. I can hold F to plea for help. And that's about it. <laughs> hmm. I don't think I can get you back from a buy station, dude. Wait, right, is there any good perks nearby for me to, like, not die? Um, quick revive... Unless we're missing something here, I don't think there is any way to get your squad mates back without physically reviving them from where they went down. I'm gonna go get quick revive. Oh, yeah, yeah. And then come get you. And then we're gonna exfil successfully with our guns. Okay. 
Everything's very expensive. Yeah. Only being able to afford one mystery box roll and Crooker 5. Yeah, in 40 minutes. We've been playing for 40 minutes. Yeah. I guess we just don't know how to make money. Probably contra- Oh, God. Yeah, contracts, I'm sure. Yeah. Oh, God. Is there any fancy animation to forgetting it? Oh, you actually do drink something. Wow. Look at that. Let's see if there's another way up. Mm, yeah, there's a staircase on the right. Well, good luck. <gasps> Get in! Oh, that's me. There. Right. Oh, it's not quick. It's so slow. It's ouch, so ouch, ouch. <laughs> it's so <laughs> slow. Wow. Shit. Well, we tried. Go kind of close. Fuck you. I wonder why you come here. Just better loot, I guess. Pack a punch in here. I don't know. Like, again, I don't know what the purpose of the mode is, you know? Like, <laughs> I mean, there's missions. You're doing missions. I guess. Like, X field, complete a contract, and ping a contract. We didn't do any of them. <laughs> <laughs> But, like, again, why would you need to go into the center? I wonder if they're... Yeah, I don't know. It's very weird. Oh, wait. We're not, like, out? Hold F to plea for help. Pleading other squads. Help! Help! I'm pleading. Help! Help! I guess we leave? <laughs> I guess. Okay. I, I'll pull us out. Um, leaving the game will forfeit any extractable items and count as a failed exfil. Well, yeah, I, I mean... I mean, we failed. Yeah. Okay. That was weird. So that was kind of an interesting first round. I do like the big open map, but I think the thing that is most confusing for me at this point is what is the overall aim here? And so story missions, we need to ping a contract, complete a contract and X first. All we got to do. Yeah. Well, why don't we do that to start? <laughs> yeah. That sounds pretty simple. <laughs> oh, think, and, yeah. oh, and they do not seem to count uh, like the next missions, you know what I mean? So like the second mission is open 25 loot caches. I have zero. Mm, okay, yeah. The third mission is kill 30 zombies with a vehicle. Do you have any progress on that? Uh, no. Oh, you, it looks like you can select any of these six. Right, but they don't count like all at the same time. You have to have it selected. That's... Just try to stretch it out. So ping a contract, complete it, and leave. That's what we're going to do, apparently. Sure. Yeah, I'll be curious how much money we get from uh, a contract. And I know in uh, Warzone 1, when you did multiple contracts in a row, you got like in an increasing multiplier. Right. Um, so it'd be like, you'd get more points for doing more contracts in a row, which maybe that'll make it way easier to get money. All right, there's an escort here. I did it, I pinged a contract. Yeah, how do you do that? There you go. I did it. We did it. Ba ding There's like a tank icon back there. Oh, yeah. I'm on my way. And that does give two grand, which is pretty good. I presume that's two grand for each of us? It might be the rover from uh, Cold War. Let's see. Whoa, that's a rocket just came down. You see that shit? I saw the shadow of it, but I did not see the actual thing. Like three rockets just landed. I did not. Uh, yeah, I don't know where that was. Huh. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's like a big rover. Yeah. Can you stand on it? You can, yeah. The ACV. Or is it moving? Oh, oh, it has to be activated. Okay. But it feels good to be in this uh, tier one place. Yeah. It's weird going from Black Ops 3 to this where there's zombie and like the, some of the zombies, uh, even at tier one, the zombies have so much more health than Black Ops. Yeah, they do. Should I go grab that purple? Ow, 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 ow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that's just money. Give me this. Oh yeah, you're right. Kind of like how different double points is in this mode, not in functionality, but in the way you take advantage of it. Usually when double points would activate, I would just kill as many zombies as I could, as quickly as I could. Now it feels like some weird boom in the economy or stock market. Maybe it's actually worth saving all your valuables, waiting for a double point and then selling everything. Ah, oh, it's it, it chews up zombies as well when it... Uh... <gasps> like the advanced warfare lawnmower. Yeah. What's this? that full power i don't know does it like uh increase melee damage i'm not sure so upon doing some research full power has been in quite a few zombie games before this and i believe it instantly charges your field upgrade is it gonna do its little rocket launch thing oh no rocket oh yeah it is there it goes ah okay that's good i'm trying to watch stuff contract complete there's a gift here uh Consume to upgrade your weapon to uncommon rarity and to play armor. I got a thing that gave, put brain rot on my gun. Ooh. I don't know what that means. <laughs> All right, now let's exfil. Sure. There's an exfil. Uh, that's the only one I see. Let's go. Sure. Go for a drive, I guess. Oh. Hi. What the? Hi, mercenaries. Oh, God. Whoa, 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 whoa. Careful, careful, careful. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's happened to our screen again? Like DDoSed? 
I don't like, I know, I don't like it. This isn't a war zone map, is it? This is like a special map. Or maybe um, this will be the war next war zone map? I think this might be the war zone 3.0 integration map. That. It looks like a recon drone. Oh, it's a counter UAV. That was what was uh, making us all weird. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, I guess we could look at what's at the buy station. There's a stinky thing here. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. It's fucking Mogwa. Oh, uh, no, Reginald, it just looks like her. Sorry. Ah. It's a mimic. Oh, I remember these guys from Outbreak. Yeah, yeah, yeah. God. Well, he's dead. Okay. Oh, I, it's turned. Yeah, I've turned this zombie. He's fighting for us briefly. What's this? Oh, is that your, like, your brain roll thing? Yeah. That's cool. Bonus points. So what is this stink fest? I don't know. I'm going to see if I can buy a gas mask. There's, um... Oh, the nest cooler. Stronghold key gas mask. A thousand. Sure. I'm going to buy a gas mask. I'm going in. Good luck. I got your back. In theory. Lock. There's a locked chest that says clear the infestation to unlock. Ooh, okay. Okay. Oh, I see. There's like weird gross pustules on the wall to yeah, shoot. Yeah, cysts. Oh, and like gross rotting zombies. Okay. LT53 Casimir times one. Casimir. Oh, yeah. There we go. It's not stanky anymore. Okay. Now I can open these chests. On death, create a tombstone stash. Oh, oh it's like a perk. Oh, tombstone. Casimir. What is this? Whoa. Whoa, it's a That's black that hole. Like, black hole thing. Oh. Yeah, I, I was using that in the last match. It's, it's good. Cool. One thing I wasn't sure about at this point is do you keep your money after eggs filling? I just want to do my money. I mean, I, got, uh, yeah, I don't know. Maybe you can buy a better gun and take the gun out with you. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I'm going to go to Pack-A-Punch. I assume it's 5,000. Yeah, I would imagine so. Because then maybe I could exfil with that Pack-A-Punch gun. I don't know. Yeah, I'm, I'm at 3,500. So if it's 5K, I'm, you know, pretty close. If we do like one more thing. Oh, God. Okay. Oh, my what God. Are you doing? <laughs> what is wrong with this vehicle? I, I don't know what's going on. Like, I, I've I'm barely touched the controls. What is happening? Do I have like a pop tire? What the <laughs> fuck? What are you doing, dude? I'm just holding W. <laughs> you drunk? <laughs> I can't control this thing. What is happening? Are we being hacked? What's going on? I don't know. Oh my god. But I'm about to die. What is happening? Okay, I'm just. Is it better driving backwards, maybe? It is. Okay. What the? Oh, God. Oh! Pack a punch. Don't mind if I do. Increased damage and ammo capacity. Is it 5k? Yeah. Still blue tier, though. I thought it would go, like, rare or legendary. Well, in Outbreak, you could, Outbreak, you could do it multiple times, right? You could... I think it was, like, four upgrades or three. Max level pack a punch reach in zone. Travel to higher threat zones for, for higher levels. Oh. Uh, okay, that makes sense. Better zones for better pack a punch. That's interesting. Yeah. Fucking god. <sighs> All right. How much is jug? Two grand. Two grand. Okay. I bought it. Was that a waste of money? Because we're about to exfil. I don't really know. Well, I mean, I don't think we bring our money with us. So. I wonder if it stays for the next round. Since our characters didn't die. Probably not. I got a grenade launcher in this backpack here. Grenade launcher. Oh. Jesus. I can call <laughs> you a ghost again. Yeah. I guess just call it in, I guess. Sure. I mean, there's no, like, humans we have to worry about, so I think the helicopter comes in in a minute, and then we just get on it and leave. I feel like they're chucking a lot of shit at us because we're exfilling. I mean, yeah, not a lot, but certainly a few. Damn, <laughs> that's cool. I like that. Damn. Oh, it's time to go. Okay. I'm in. Okay. Can they get us? Oh, they can. They can get on. Ah, it's like transit. Back off. My chopper. Back off. Whoa. <laughs> Just kills the pilot. Hey, it comes with us. That's cool. That's fun. Okay. We did it. So it begins. So that was another round, I guess. Uh, we did do a mission objective list chunk thing. And we took back some guns, so yeah. Um, I, 
I guess that's the mode. One thing I did do is I went and I looked through all the objectives that are at least viewable in Act 1. And I don't know about this system. I actually quite like the idea of there being a bunch of linear missions to progress through. But reading through all these objectives here, they just don't seem very interesting. It just feels like you're doing a bunch of benign and random activities. You're not playing how you naturally would. I feel like this format could be interesting, but I just don't think these objectives are interesting. This is so different that it feels like, I don't know. I don't, I don't yeah. dislike it. Oh, but it, essence value extracted. Oh. Wait, oh, does that just mean XP Oh, maybe? XP, I think, yeah. So you can level up for bringing money. Okay, yeah. Yeah, it's very weird, isn't it? Like, I don't dislike it because it's, it's laid back, but it just feels like the whole soul is gone completely. Oh, yeah, yeah. It doesn't feel like zombies at all. It's just... It doesn't feel like zombies at all. Like you said, it's like DMZ, but there are also just zombies. Yeah, it's weird. I mean, like... I don't really give a shit because I'm not like a hardcore zombie fan. So to me, it's kind of quite interesting. But I just wonder how we got here. I think they just had DMZ and they needed like a third pillar yeah. to sell MW3 with, right? And and so they just said, well, we can turn DMZ into a zombies mode in eight months and we can pitch it as zombies as the third pillar. I think that's all it is, really. Be interested to know what people think about it. I found a whole bunch of other bullshit. Some of it's actually kind of interesting. So under gear... Yeah. So I extracted with my tier two backpack and my grenade launcher, like I kept everything. Um, and one of the rewards I got, I have no idea how I got it, is I can just give myself Juggernaut. It's like a one-time use item that I can just put in my backpack. I think we got that from the mission. If you go to missions, it was under... Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Rewards. So there's also schematics in, that, in those menus and there's a whole bunch of shit in here. Uh including Wonder Weapons, Ray Gun, and Ooh. Wonder Waff, DG2. I have no idea how you get the schematics. Maybe they're all story mission rewards? Yeah, like it's chill. Yeah. But it's also, it also seems completely aimless outside of just doing a bunch of random missions from the menus. Yeah. Well, gear and loot is a big thing, right? You extract with your loot, right? Right, yeah. So you loot, do these like kind of grindy, almost like MMO based side quests. Pretty much, yeah. They're like destiny bounties. Yeah. Like they're completely, yeah. And then you eventually grind away until you can do like a mission thing. But honestly, like most of the objectives seem really easy. Yeah. And so I could see myself just to level up, just loading this up solo and just slowly grinding through them just to level up, you know, yeah. to get to max level for later. Oh, you. This is where we exfilled from. I wonder if that's just a coincidence or... Yeah, oh, you're right, yeah. Well, we just have to loot things. I like looting. Yeah, me too. I'm just going to go start doing that. <laughs> Wait, these are gray guns. Mine were blue before. Hmm. And mine was pack-a-punched, not pack-a-punched. They're like back to being lame. Weird. I don't get it. Is it because it was contraband? Or... No, no, I don't think so. Maybe you can't carry in like rarities of guns ever. Yeah, maybe. Why would my stuff not carry over? I kind of thought that was the whole part of DMZ. You get like loot and it carries over. Yeah, I don't know. And then when you die, you're sad because you've lost a bunch of stuff. Are we missing something here when it comes to not carrying over the rarity of the weapons per match? Because what's the point of extracting your guns if they're just going to always go down to the grey tier immediately afterwards? Surely that makes them just instantly worse than any like green, blue, purple piece of crap that you find in the mystery box or on a wall? This is like the one part of the loot system which I don't really get yet. I found a there's so there's this turret I looked at at the end of the last match. It's like up on the roof of the building we exfilled from. Yeah. But it had no, there was nothing going on to it. But then I just found a thing that lets me put in, it says activates a deadbolt turret with shatter blast. And I think, no, uh, how do I, oh, deposit, deposit. I turned a turret on. Wow, this is so exciting. Oh, he's killing guys. Holy shit. I fucking hope so. This turret's cracked. Oh my God. <laughs> it's like an aimbot turret from across the map. This thing's unbelievable. Holy shit. He's popping off. Did it cost money? Uh, no, I, I found a, an item that I could put in it to turn it on, or I could sell that item for 200 bucks. But it, aside from that, it was free. It was an enemy car. Jesus. Oh. <laughs> huh. These purple fuckers. Okay, those things seem good. Wow. Eat my cluster mine, purple fucker. The mine. Wow, what the? I did it. <laughs> Oh no, he's alive, fuck. Nice. I got, I got like EMP'd by something. Ow! <laughs> Plastered by myself, it hurts. 
vintage bottle of wine in here. Let's just you fucking commit. What is this purple thing? I don't get it. Hmm, wine sounds good. How much is it worth? A hundred, uh, oh, a thousand. Holy shit. For the wine? Yeah. Some good wine, baby. It's a good bottle of red. Oh, hello. So, welcome, mercenaries. It doesn't, it doesn't. You fucking cheers. What? That's bullshit. Oh, I lord them in here. Got one bullet. Two kills. What is this? Send transmission to H7. What does that do? This is weirdly reminding me, uh, uh, beyond, outside of the, like, the DMZ parts of it, just the tone here of the, like, just walking around and there's not really anything happening and there's occasionally, like, a, a zombie or something. It reminds me of Redfall right now. <laughs> oh, boy. Yeah. I thought you were going to say, like, PUBG. <laughs> it reminds me of PUBG. No. Well, yeah, a little bit as well, but it's the, like, sort of pseudo-Halloween, you know, setting. Except there's just no, there's just nothing, there's just nothing going on. That's what it's really reminding me of right now. Oh, interesting. I, um, oh, okay. So that's not bad. So when you complete a mission that doesn't involve Xville, it auto rolls to the next mission. So I completed my opening 25 things and I'm now on kill 30 zombies by running them over and repair one vehicle tire. Oh. Okay. That's good that you don't have to like manually switch it each time. Okay. It just rolls through them. That's not bad. Get out of here, dude. I'm rolling the mystery box. Oh, he's shooting the mystery box. He's doing the old classic strat. Oh, God. A dead shot daiquiri. What is that? I think that does anything. It's very civilized. We're taking turns. Every this is so weird, man. I don't like this, like, friendly Call of Duty strangers. This is freaking me out. We're, like, being civilized with each other, and uh, it's very, very disturbing. He is shooting the mystery box. Oh, he got a wonder weapon! Oh, there's wonder weapons in a mystery box. Okay, maybe I have to shoot the weapon as well. Shoot the box. <laughs> no, don't buy into that shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's gonna work. <laughs> it didn't work. <laughs> what do you get? Was that a big purple dick one? Uh, it was. It was the crazy huge dick gun. Yeah. Oh, big dick gun. Oh, I got a Wonder Waff. Oh, nice. Wonder Waff DG. You've never got that gun before. No. I haven't seen that gun since World at War. World at War. That's right. It looks cool. Yeah, the Wonder Wolf's cool, man. I presume I, I can exfil with it as well, which is good. Look at it. Yeah. I think it looks more gold than last time. Yeah. I'm going to go get this car and start running guys over, I guess. <laughs> yeah, sure. I don't really know what else to do. Oh, the mushy box does move. I got a teddy bear. Oh, it does. Oh, interesting. Interesting. Well, knowing now that the missions just like cycle through as you play, I could, you know, yeah, I, I can see just, just hanging out for like a couple hours, just, you know. You do rant, you do a bunch of things, and then you stop playing for the night, and nothing really ever happens, and that's okay. <laughs> I feel like it's, I don't know, it just feels like it's missing something. Oh, yeah, no, I agree. It's just like <laughs> nothing's really happening. <laughs> no, exactly, yeah. Like, it's completely fine. Yeah. I would call it, um, like, non-offensive. Completely, yeah. Like, I don't mind pointing and clicking at things, that's fine. Oh, I got a- I got a random perk. Me too, damn nice. Yeah, it was a power-up. Ooh, I like the Wonder Waff. That's that seems this seems oh yeah yeah I like this gun. Yeah, Wonder Waff's good. Is that a bad guy? It's a bad. Well, these vehicles are weird, dude. They just like turn randomly. I think you have a, if I think if it's doing I think that means you have a popped tire. Oh, weird. Yeah, it's very discombobulating. I guess you're building up to go to the center. I guess, but why? Um, probably better stuff. Yeah, but why? <laughs> what do you need better stuff for? That's I guess the question is like. Is the story mission, you know, in the dead center of the map and really hard? Yeah, it's got to be really hard, right? It has to be, right? It's yeah. got to be leading towards something. Because right. if it's not, if you get to the story mission and then it just is like in a tier one zone, then I don't know why you'd ever go into the center. I've yet to see anyone venture even past like a third of the way into the tier two zone. Yeah. Just sort of looking at the map. I love how we're just, we haven't seen each other like this entire game as well. We're just out doing our own yeah. thing. Like, yeah. there's like no co-op or anything. I've got friends helping me now. Yay. Oh, he's got a dead bull. I don't, I don't even have to. I can just go AFK and I've got random human players here helping me do this. This is amazing. There definitely is a kind of fun novelty to running into strangers and goofing around with them or having some sort of collaborative moment. One weird thing is a lot of the mission objectives are not squad based. They track individually. So in this match, Jameson went on to the next chunk of missions before me. So we split in aims, we had different objectives. So we just ran off and did our own thing in different places. It was like we weren't even in a squad or having the same aim. I don't know, it's just, again, it's just a little weird to me. 
The note present over there. Reward gift. Uh, that was for doing a thing. A, um, a mission. So it, sa it sits around until you get it as well, I guess. Ooh. Rare Ethereum Crystal or something. Consume to pack a bunch of weapons to level one. Oh, stow. I'm low on fuel. Ah. I can make it. Right there. Roll down the hill. Perfect. Ding, ding. Ah, shit. There's fucking mercenaries here. Ah. Ah. No. You fucking assholes. Ruin my day. Merc camp cleared. Can my car make it? All right. Pack a punch. Yes. My Wonder Waff is now purple. That's cool. Max level reached in zone. I see. Okay. No, out of fuel. No. Can I bring fuel to it? I don't know. I have not seen any uh, jerry cans anywhere. What the hell? Now this place stinks and is gassed. I just did this. You assholes. Oh, fuck it out. I'm going to go to... Where are you at? Oh, you're way over there. Right, I'm sick of this, dude. Let's exfil and get out of here. There's a plane here. Plane? There's an exfil trooper just here. What the... What did we just do? Oh, is it just other players leaving? No, they like exfilled a thing. Oh, weird. I got a perk that, um, what, what was the perk from Black Ops 2 where you could see the outlines of, uh, stashes and loot and perks and something? Vulture, yeah. I got something like that. Except it also shows enemies, sort of. That's kind of good. Yeah. Like, gives them a little outline when they're behind a wall. Well, I'll, uh, call the helicopter, I suppose. Sure. You're pretty close by. Yeah. Ooh, a lot of zombies just spawned. How exciting. I don't believe you. Where? Finally, some enemies. <laughs> There's a lot of zombies here. There's actually like a lot of zombies here. Yeah, there is. It's kind of kind of fun. I have any uh, armor. Oh boy. This could get sketchy. It's the kill, baby! I guess the longer you're in, the more zombies probably spawn when you exfil. It's the kill! Makes it a little harder. This is not the gun for this. I don't have like a really like super fast gun. Yeah. This is kind of cool. There's a lot going on here. It's a lot of zombies. There's an exfil. Yeah. Get out of here. They're coming up through the floor, I see it. Get a bomb. I got a nuke. <laughs> well, the Wonder Waff seems great. I love it. Yeah, My new great. favorite gun of all time. <laughs> Woo. Well, that was exciting, actually getting to shoot some zombies at the end there. That was kind of fun. Yeah. Uh, everything between that, the last 40 minutes leading up to that was not interesting, though. <laughs> No, there's just like not a whole lot going on. No, like if there were if there were way more zombies in like other I don't know if you could get like that density of zombies to sort of spawn when you wanted to yeah. do stuff that might be interesting, but it's just so quiet. I still have my Ethereum crystal. I th think that's all I have. <laughs> yeah, I did not get my Wonder Waff. That's lame as well. Having the whole armory fools, I don't know, it just doesn't feel like the same spirit. Like the same goofy, silly spirit. No, it's very weird across the board. Here we go, yeah. I've got like a weird hostile takeover EBR from the gunsmith, which I can just equip for zombies. So you can take in whatever gun you want, but it would be like a weak gun. Unless you used yeah. a Eutherium crystal on it. Uh, sure. <laughs> <laughs> whatever you say. Weird. Yeah. Well, guys, that is going to about wrap it up for our initial exploration phase. I continue to be really baffled by the loot system in this game, specifically in the context of wanting to exfil with your loot, because everything you can exfil with, at least so far, feels like items that can just be easily bought in a shop or just found on the ground or it's a gray tier gun which you're just going to replace instantly you can't take wonder weapons back either i don't know maybe we're just early here uh, and maybe we haven't learned enough to understand this system yet i don't know i just don't get it however this is not the end of our Modern Warfare Zombies Exploration. What is this game called? I'll just call it MWZ, I guess. We have two more MWZ videos recorded already and coming up in the following weeks. They will not be a part of this main series. From here on out, MWZ will be graduating into the Breaking Modern Warfare 3 series and eventually the Mythbuster series as well. But those videos will still contain elements of us exploring and learning this 
mode, since this map is pretty dense and contains a lot of secrets and new mechanics to get through, so make sure to keep an eye out for all of our upcoming MWZ videos if you want to follow along with every part of our zombie journey. I'm also super interested in what you guys think of this mode. I really can't quite get a gauge on how the community feels about this thing yet. I've seen a lot of mixed opinions all over the place and yeah, just let me know down below. Apart from that, thanks again to the patrons who have supported the continuation of this series. It continues to not really grow in terms of view count. If anything, this series has actually decreased in views, so if you want to show support and interest in this series continuing, consider supporting it on Patreon. Thank you to our newest Patreons, Random Stereotype, 12 Jar Jar Bins, Mr. Cosmic, Wummy, Duck Cunt, Alpha Monster, Nine Circles, Jonathan, Ginny, Captain Awesome, Vault Pigs, AI, Laron, Joan, Bugnut, Joseph, Luigi, Jonathan, Will, Dirty Old Man, Damien, Niall, and Jacob. Thank you very much, guys. I appreciate it. Modern Warfare 3 has definitely delayed our progress with Chapter 12, and will probably continue to do so for the next few weeks. But as long as you patrons have our backs, this journey will eventually get done. Thank you guys for watching. More MWZ coming soon, and Chapter 12 is coming when it's ready. We will see you then.